Okay, so a lot of people seem really confused or just didn't watch enough of my most recent video, so I'm gonna go over what I found very quickly. If you watch any of my videos, you know I had a hang-mounted GPU or a double vertical where it hangs from the top down to the bottom. Not only have I tested many cards, but I've had quite a few double vertical mounted GPUs and I've never ran into the problem where it causes them to nearly thermal throttle within 30 seconds. And I don't know where any of you heard differently, but having your GPU's hotspot go into the 100, 110 degrees Celsius range is absolutely terrible for the longevity of your graphics card. And due to me never having this issue with a hang mounted graphics card, I thought my new GPU was defective. But if you look at my other video, I did test it in this orientation and the temperatures dropped by 45 degrees to 35 degrees Celsius on the hotspot, which is perfectly normal then. Seems perfectly fine now that I have it horizontally vertical mounted and look I would have never made it to 68% beforehand and we're only at 63 degrees on the hotspot as much as I would love to make a professional video redoing all of these tests I don't think you guys have the attention span for it and I personally don't feel comfortable putting my card through such intense temperature fluctuations it's just not good for a graphics card and yes it's still running but I hope this cleared up any confusion with my prior video and if you have a hang mounted graphics card this right here is your sign to check your GPU's temperatures because I would cry right along with you if you killed it without even knowing it.